So, welcome back again to another day, but with a different mod pack. I wonder what it's called. Just like the title says, it's Mineshaft and Mine Shafts and Monsters. It's a new mod pack, a good one at that. But and we'll be starting our new series. This one. As you can see from the whatever this is, I don't know what this guy is, because <laughs> I don't know yet. But here, we're going to our save world to start the stream. Although it will take a while, like 2-3 minutes for the game to start. I mean for the lo world to load or something, but yeah. So, how are you? Welcome. Sorry I didn't continue my Craft to Exile series for day 7. But that will come back. Because I will, I will try to alternate the series. Minecraft and Man Monsters and Craft to Exile. You know, like Craft to Exile, Minecraft, Craft to Exile, Minecraft, like that. But I will maybe try three exiles, two Minecraft and Monsters in a week, or if I can do it with, you know. Like today, which is a Saturday. Let's see. Yes, it's a Saturday. Try that. Monday. Yeah. Here is the world of my chefs and monsters. I think I moved a little bit, you know, just to uh, settle down the uh, world loading and something. But here's the goal of this mod pack. First goal is to kill a uh, illager. Also, I have one mod installed here that is escaping. I know it's kind of shitty and cheaty, but I kind of need it, you know. I need it. First things first. Oh yeah, it's because of this one mod that we have right here. I think it's tree chop mod. Oh shit, not that one. Yeah, tree chop makes. Uh, Trees or any kind of things that has a stock. Break the whole thing like that. Goes the same with the trees as well. So. Hmm. Oh. Sounds kinda new. Getting that kind of sounds that breaks up the whole thing but not really the leaves so I'll just do this first what's with the fucking sound also there's this physics I have to turn it off it's kind of you know I call this disorienting disorienting something yeah, it's kind of weird to my eyes. I have to turn that off. Oof. There's that sound you get when... Every time I go to op music and options, the master volume gets, you know, high for some reason. 
Also, there's something about fame in this mod pack. Let me just turn this one on so that I'll know. Yeah, this show skill list that corner, which should show right there. Skill list. Ooh, where is it? Uh, drop size, max capacity, blah 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 blah. Either way, if ever there's any progress that I have in this pack, it would show up right here. There's also quite hard something hard about this pack is that there's a lot of enemies. There's also oh, just like that. You see. Our first Ah, uh, I think I'm gonna die in this one. Charge. There you go. That's the first kill for our start of the series. I know there's another one. Oh there it is. There's the dude. It's a ricochet. Ooh. That sounds like a good enchant. Surprise game, projectile protection, sweet put it. Ooh, thank goodness for that swift footed enchant. Really helps with running away. Great start, huh? What a great start. Thanks to this? Oh! Oh, that's really great. Thank goodness that exists. Because I really want to start off my base right here. Since this is the spawn area. And because it is a spawn area, that there's a natural chunk loading in it. So I really don't want to go get away, get far away from the chunk er, chunk spawn area or something. So I'm gonna start my my colonies here, so that whenever I'm gone from the the place. The location stays loaded because of that. And also we get this My Will book whenever we kill an Ill I mean the first time you kill an illager. Like this. This is a message to my fellow adventurers. My name is Steve. As of right now, dozens of illagers are outside my doorstep. And I think I'm not going to make it through to sunrise. Skip lore, go to page four. But since this is the start of our series of this mod pack, we're gonna read all of it. Those bastards are likely to be curious of this book and take possession of it. Luckily, they can beat our language. Dumb villagers, am I right? In the unlikely chance that someone may rescue this will from the grasp of those unholy creatures, I hope to pass on my limited knowledge of this world to the next person, so that they don't have to suffer the same fate as me. This world looks similar but vastly different. Differs in how it works. Get the first steps wrong, and it can cripple you your journey here. Here are everything I know about this world. The vile and horrifying creatures in this world can burn down villages in seconds. Maybe there's Maybe that's why the villagers are so aggressive to strange faces. Don't try to get in villagers in the first few days. The guards in iron columns are not friendly to us. You must gain their trust by killing their sworn enemies, villagers. With a better reputation, they will ease up a little bit. A little bit. Sorry about that. 
Do not kill villagers, guards, or iron golems. That will sabotage your reputation in a matter of seconds. However, there is a rumor that humans can learn dark magic by sacrificing quote unquote killing ten villagers or guardians of the swamps. Told sentinels. I didn't suit that low. With a good enough reputation, you'll be able to deal trades with villagers and learn about their culture. Some villagers have been torched by dragons before, so you will be will make a profitable trade selling them the remains of dragons. If you manage to beat one, <laughs> all right, sad, sad, satyrs, satyrs are friends of the villagers. Treat them poorly, and the villagers will do the same to you. If you're planning to travel by sea, it's better to pay tributes to the god of the sea, Poseidon. Craft an altar of Poseidon and give him offerings. Do not fish by stabbing fish in the sea, that's considered disrespectful. In this world, use a fishing rod if you have to eat fish. Noted on that. There are only two goals in this world, defeat the Ender Dragon and build your kingdom. However, I couldn't locate the stronghold at all. I've heard rumors that the portal has been relocated to a fancy castle. Also, the eyes of Ender doesn't work in a portal anymore. You have to travel to different parts of the world to look for the individual eyes. I've only been able to locate the old eye in the pyramids. But I know there are many more. This world works on favor, relationships, <laughs> and reputation. Without it, you're nothing. I've heard legends of the bell ringer and Dame Fortuna, but they wouldn't respond to my son. <clears throat> Sorry about that. I'm not an honored man after all. Honor is built around your kingdom. With enough human living in your community, you will slowly gain the respect of both your citizens and the outsiders. Maybe by then, the legendary bosses will adhere to your summon. Besides that, legendary gears can be crafted once you received and reached a prestige level. That's all I know about this world. And now I must say farewell. farewell. Before I lose the chance to do so, Good luck on your adventure, my good sir. That's the goal. So, as far as I know, in order to gain uh, trust of the villagers, you have to kill villagers. I don't know, I think if I have to estimate that you have to kill around 10 or more or so, so that you'll be able to gain their trust, gain their trust as in be able to talk, I mean, which is the first stage, not being killed by the, by the guards. That is only the first stage. And then, ah, uh, give me a moment, I'm thinking. And then next, I think you need to kill a bit more villain villagers to gain, gain access to traits. That's what I know. There we go. Yeah, I really well. I know a little bit. You know, just a. Uh, a little bit of knowledge on this mod pack. It's almost close. But I will be sharing that to you as far. I mean, from how far I've gotten to this mod pack. Oh, yeah, I've crafted this. This is the start of gaining fame just by. Do my colonies. I had to really make it good, you know. Make it look good, guys. From the world that I've 
played with in my own personal world playing this mod pack. The buildings are ugly as shit. But I hope I can uh, make it. I mean, uh, make make it really good in this pack. I mean, in this world, this time. Okay, so mm, I'm thinking what kind of building are we gonna use? Maybe this one? No, it's too open. Okay, let's see. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Hmm. This is like the usual for every... Anyone that would try to do this. This build. It's almost sundown, so I really need to... Do this fast. Let me see. I have to make it ground level as well. So that I can build this thing. Uh, come on. I don't want any monsters to spawn on the first day. No, not uh, not yet. Thing. Uh, we have mine colonies to teach us to do these things. We can get through these uh, blocks, in between the blocks, to be able to see which parts needs to be mined or dug. Sorry about that mini lag spikes. I really hate it when that happens. Oops. This one looks fine. Looks fine, looks fine. Good, 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 good. All I have to do now is just clear this one up. And then the grass. That's the only one that's uh, blocking through our progress. Let's see. I really like it though that there's three stuff you get just by putting up five crafting up five chests into this but the only downside is that you can only use it once but it's a good downside either way Ooh, boy. sorry about the flashing lights your whatever that's called sensitive to this stuff okay that should be good enough huh oh Let's just uh, do a little bit more. Maybe there's more grass that's been that ha I haven't broken yet. Yep, there it is. Uh-huh. 
Uh huh. This looks fine. This looks fine. Everything is looking fine. I move it a little bit. Huh. Flat solid ground places of FFR shipping, blah blah blah. What is it? This is so stressful. How about that? Fuck yes, finally. Here we go. Start of our mine colony adventure. Great. Okay, let's bring all of this stuff there. Bring the bed, bed too. Ow. Here is our house. Okay, let's put all the blocks here. Anything plant related here or food and the weapons oops another one of those nice bikes of mine I really hate that this one contains the thing needed for my colonies and stuff here we go I need a chest for four. Come on. I'll just put it right here. Tools, that town hall, my will. Bit of arrows. So let's start planting this thing. If I have any uh, if I can find it. I think it's right here. No, that's just a gold pop. Let's put that right there. I guess it was here. Yes, it is here. No, it's still the same one. Oh yeah, we got it. Sugar cane. That's the thing that I need. Sugar cane and bamboo. They're not really useful yet. And I will plant them, you know, beforehand, for useful, for use later on, and stuff. There we go. Okay. Hmm. Should I use dark oak, stone, or what? I think I'm gonna put this, the first one, or not yet. I think we'll, we're gonna have to gather some things before we start there. And I need to gather... This, that, and a bunch of wood. We're gonna need a lot of wood if we're gonna continue. This tree chop things. It's kind of better than the old tree chop thing. Because the old one. You have to break the whole thing before it, fu it fell, which is kind of annoying and really, 
actually really slow because it reads all the number of blocks that a tree has and it will uh, decrease the speed of breaking the tree before it fell down. Uh, it's not really increased, it's decreased. But thankfully this uh, dark oak forest has regular oak trees that would really help with the progress of making a town because I really wanna I'm planning on using the wooden wooden type of mine colonies ooh apples so the first thing that I need to build with mine colonies is after the town hall and the builder, it is a farm, a restaurant, and a carrier, and a warehouse. You know, uh, for the sake of feeding them, because I really don't like to, you know, wait. I mean, I really don't want to bother feeding them myself. So I'm just gonna let the villagers do that themselves, rather than me. This that's poop. There's a lot of things you can do in this mod pack, but all the the first things we need to do right now is gain fame, and only do that by increasing the population of your kingdom, which is the Mine colonies. So a lot of houses, a lot of villagers, a lot of children building a tavern so that you know you can hire people from whatever or whatever mine colony villager come came from. Hey, I gotta make the tavern as well. Also, there, here's also one more tip. Don't go for regular double chests. Go for these types of chests. These crates from Druidcraft. Pretty good stuff. Give me a moment. Uh, let me make more. Yeah, these things are great. Uh, where should I put this? This, 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 this. Let me just uh, remove this, these things from here. What's really great about these things is that it has really high capacity. Like so. Ooh, look at that fat chest. Move fat size, more size. I'm just gonna put that there. Oh, not that one. I'm gonna bring that when I'm mining and stuff. This, I don't know why, but I'm just gonna keep that there. So I just need more. There we go. Huh, kinda no music, huh? Uh, pretty bland right now, but yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Okay. There we go. We're gonna put all the plant type here. Same goes coming from here. I guess it's gonna read if I put it here. Yep, it is. Yeah, I'm gonna make another set. Just one more. 
to make it look more appealing, you know. I really like clean look, like so. But doesn't have that thing in the thing, but eh, whatever. Let's go for blocks for this one. I'm gonna use force and all the hard stuff in here. This put food here or plant life. Yeah, I don't know. I'm taking the boots. <laughs> Wood related to here. I think that's good enough. Although I need to make another. Yeah. Let's go down, I, th I think. Where should I start? Hmm. If I want to start, let me. Make a little thing right here. A little mine. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I need to make torches. Finally, I got to the stone. Need to make some shovel because my what? Villagers won't build walls on villages, village roads like grass paths. I see. Because in my personal world, I see villagers, you know, try to build stuff. Weird. They end very inconsistent. They just you know build everywhere and ev anywhere, and they don't have a pattern. And it's really uh, messing with my OCD. It ticks me off. Well, that's fine. They're just villagers. What dumb people? What? Like the dumb kind. Also, I think make some. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Since I have a one point sixteen point four or excavation, I have this excavate shape. Oh no 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 no! Stairs down. Hey what? That's the wrong one. Oh goodness. Let's see. Yes, it was like this. Yep. Oh, oh, oh. Hmm. Although it looks nice, but it's not. Hmm. Let's see. Ah, let's start with here. Shit. There it is. Phew. That 
that side again because that we messed it all up. The reason I'm trying to do this is because I really need to go down below, get some resources and all that garbozo. Since I have a lot of stone pickaxes, it's just gonna replace them. There we go. We're finally hitting that part. Really, this? No, it's this one. Yes, yes. Oh shit. Oh shit, that's a bad. That's really bad. But let's get this. I, I don't care if I'm in the ocean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? I gotta abide by the rules. You haven't seen me do this, right? It's my way of placing downstairs. I remove that. Put that down first so that there's no mobs that will spawn here. Here is my way. You have to set it face on an angle and then place down. That way, while you're running up to the surface, you're continuously placing downstairs. That way, you won't, you know, get fucked when doing so. I think here would be a good spot. What is this? Oh, it's marble. Because that's heading down that side. It's almost night time as well. The way I'll know it is because of the map turning dark for a little bit. That way I know that it's almost bedtime. I have to, uh, come on. There we go. Gotta not, uh, let myself get hit by Poseidon's wrath. Ooh, it's not really, really nice. Let's see. Where are my sticks? I'm gonna need to make more big access. There we go. I'll need more shovels. Either way, because of how harsh it's gonna be down there. Sticks and stuff. There we go. Mm, am I making it right? No. There we go. No, that's not right. That's not right either. Oh shit. That was a skeleton. <laughs> Let me make a 
Oh shit. I know there is a skeleton right there. Evil breaking bones. What is a what? Oh, oh! I don't have a snowball. I have a snowball too. Wow! It's good to know. Gotta be careful the paths that I go to. That part is already in Ocean's domain. I don't wanna mess with that. <laughs> now let's close that off. We're gonna need to go down deeper. There we go. Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, I place and decide because that's it will detect that it's a stone or I invite you to your death. Come at me, bitch. I know that the long the deeper you are in this pack, the harder the stone gets. The harder the stone gets, the more you get hungry. Kidding me? It's the first boss already. I'm gonna kill it. First skill boys, or boss skill. <gasps> Ooh, what is this? Oh shit! This is scary man. Thing that I'm like behind <laughs> these walls. Shit, 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 shit,
fucking extended caves. God. I didn't pick up the goddamn. Please, it's just baby skeleton. I mean, baby creepers. Come here. Thank God. Come here, closer. Come here, closer. There you are. Where's that motherfucker? I wanna take my chances. Try to get him. Oh, fucker! It's just a mini creeper. God damn it! Can you stop placing them? Are they friendly? Christ. I still really want to kill it though. Although they don't really deal that much damage, they're really annoying because of that effect. Ooh. Really, 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 really overstepping my boundaries right here. Where is it? Fucking... Come closer, skeleton. Holy shit. chest I see a chest down there it seems that the skeleton died I wasn't able to kill it though I wanted to get its armor oh boy Well, 
like that. I like to know that. Oh. Oh, is this one of those? Nice. Yeah, this is one of those. Yeah. It's like underground abandoned houses. You can get some very good stuff from them. So, potato. Can't leave that down here. Copper ore from ice and fire. I'll make use of that when I. Wow. And I actually need it. Oops. Wrong angle. Let's see. There. There. That was almost there. Sometimes I fail, but we get there eventually. Uh -uh -uh. There. <laughs> Much more easier to determine. Enchant with mom. What is this though? What can you do with this? Do you enchant mobs with this? Food is more nourishing and satisfying than consumed, which I will use when I get enough. Let's see here. Iron ore, wood, copper. You know what? Here go, mob drops. Okay, let's get back. We're gonna need to go down there to close the bedrock or layer 11 stuff. There's some means. Oh, I can make use of that. Mm, lucky. Cool. Getting deeper now, and blocks are getting tougher. Making me hungrier every break. Oh boy. For now, dealing with enemies is kinda hard for me. Alright, broke that. That, 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 that. Oh shit, we're already at the layer, optimal layer. 
which is 12 or 11. Go down deeper more. It's gonna be tougher because blocks are. It's gonna get even tougher. Let's get of these redstone ores since they're also experience, which would increase my amount of health. Like so. Crazy effect from going down deeper in this mod pack. It seems that the even lower layers are shit in this in this world. There's blackstone. There's molten blackstone. Yeah, I knew it. Ah, nether like. I wanna get this one, which I cannot break yet. This one, so I can have a chance to break that one, and I hope that the pickaxe. Oh yes, oh yes, yes, yes. Oh yes, 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 yes. Beautiful. I like these ones because they're close to diamond level, but more. With more, what do you call this? Durability. It's perfect. Okay. Ooh, that's spike. As always. enough to form the whole thing. Right. Oh. Ores. Let's read here. Oh, wait. Why is it only two? I thought it got around three. I know, I know, I know I got around three. Shit. There it is. There's the last one. Motherfucker almost took it away from me. I like this fleet footed enchantment. Making me run fast like that. Glad that you don't need fame for this. So I think I will hmm, continue on using this stone pickaxe, then iron, and the rest will be using the stone ones and gathering materials. Stone, I don't want it. 
breaks that shit. Really eats on my hunger. Saturation? I guess bowls will do. Like so. See that? I mean, the durability of my tools. Ooh, boy. Eats a lot. Let me see, do I have any planes close to me? Oh, I know that shape. I know that shape. That's a mines area. One of those structures that looks like a mine. They are quite nice. I confuse what I'm doing. I'm trying to find diamonds. Ooh. I really don't want to mine lava stone. Uh, it's a hunger killer. Anyway. It's a good thing that mobs don't spawn on bedrock. Huh. Having a tough time finding diamonds in this area. Wonder why. Does it have to do with uh, location or something? Eesh. Place has been eaten up by blackstone. Can't find any diamonds. Oh, found one. Wait. Oh, I have respiration too. That's why. Two and one. Beautiful. Three. Just good enough. You know, I really like about these fiery glasses. They're a good type of torches. Beautiful types. You wanna know why they're a good type of torch? You can place them down in water. Hey. Bad area. Good. Not the area I'm looking for. Uh, let's get back. Oh, there it is. Fuck oh, yes. Uh, only one? What a waste. Hey, hey. 
Fuck you, lava. Ah, yes, it is. see something in the distance okay diamonds <gasps> oh next bike again nothing to worry about You motherfucker. Come here. Die like your friend. Didn't even drop me anything. There you go. Only bases, huh? But I guess emeralds will do. Uh, chains. I think I'll need chains later. Maybe. Chain line. Oh. That's worm tongue. Sticky chain line. Disconnect two chain mobs. Do sticky this Usually similar to lead. Lead can be tied to all blocks. Cannot be broken. Can be used in most mobs. So, oh, that sounds like a nice slave chain. Well, you know, what you use in slaves. Diamonds. Hell yeah. Good part about these parts. There we go. Proper tool. Got two diamonds from that. I think I won't be lost. Yeah, I'll know because of that. Yep, yep. it's the same place. Is it right here? No, it's not right there. There it is. Aha! Got a lot from that. You got a lot from that. Now I think I'm gonna end this for today. I know it's not a lot. I didn't uh, give a lot of information that we did get into. What's that? Holy shit, what are you? <gasps> no, 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 no. I've been looking for an arachnon, but not that kind of arachnon. Jesus fucking Christ. Jesus fucking Christ, that's 
Oh, I think I can, I can cheese this. I think I can cheese this. Where is it? I hope I can cheese this. It's right there, right? Jesus Christ. That's how the arachnon sounds like. I don't usually use that form when I'm playing. So I don't. You fucker. <gasps> no! I wrapped on crystals! Crystal. God fucking damn it. Stupid, stupid, stupid infernal mod, or whatever it's called. Took my chances to get a fucking Arachnon Crystal. I need an Arachnon Crystal. Around five of it. At least I didn't die. Uh, hell yeah. That'll be it for today. See you again tomorrow. Maybe next week because it's already Saturday and tomorrow is Sunday and I'm gonna take a break from that. Even though I've already took a fucking month <laughs> to start streaming again. <laughs> uh, bye. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. Goodbye.